Hi Taurus, this is a peek at your partner for the week of March the 12th through March the 18th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Taurus for March the 12th through March the 18th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Taurus for March the 12th through March the 18th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Taurus for March the 12th through March the 18th, 2023. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Taurus. Taurus, this is a peek at your partner. So, Taurus, your partner has the Nine of Pentacles. Your partner has the Ace of Cups. Your partner has the Two of Swords. Your partner has the Ace of Pentacles. And your partner has the Five of Pentacles. So, Taurus. Your partner has the Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner saying, with, without, or in spite of anyone, I alone, in my own right, am abundant, self-sufficient, independent, and single. I'm single. So, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're independently abundant on their own or they're single. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. For Taurus's partner, clarify the nine of pentacles. For Taurus's partner, it is clarified with the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with a Pisces, but your partner could tell me that they're in the dark concerning something. Your partner could tell me that they're using their intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon for Taurus's partner. Clarify the moon for Taurus's partner. Clarify the moon for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is someone rushing into your partner or your partner rushing in to start a passionate, creative new endeavor. Now, someone could be rushing in, going off, going ham passionately, rushing in with the spark of a new idea, rushing in with some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this wand is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. This is flighty energy, in and out energy, player energy. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that there's a rush to do something. Could be a rushing in, going off, going ham passionately with a heated discussion or argument. Or someone was out being a player getting cookies somewhere. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Queen of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This queen is a very fiery, feisty, bold, and confident energy. Someone who handles their business with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Wands. Now, the Queen of Wands is someone who's highly motivated, a self-starter, someone who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or your partner is wanting to take action here. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. 
Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the hangman. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the hangman signifies that the relationship is stagnant right now. It's suspended in the air. There is no movement, but your partner may be beginning to change their perspective. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with a Pisces, but your partner is telling me that you guys are stagnant or something is hanging in the balance, but they could be changing their perspective here. Clarify the hangman for Taurus's partner. Clarify the hangman for Taurus's partner. Clarify the hangman for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the page of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is immature, premature communication. But this is also your partner spying, researching, investigating, looking into someone, looking into someone's social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, riding past someone's home, riding past someone's job, asking a friend of a friend of a friend. This is your partner doing their due diligence to gather information and research, looking into something. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys had some immature, premature communication. Or they went looking and spying. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the three of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is heartbreak. This is pain. This is suffering. This is agony caused by a third party situation. So when I say third party, yes, a romantic third party. But this could also be meddling family members, friends, co-workers, neighbors, anyone being involved in you guys' relationship that shouldn't be that is causing your partner heartbreak. So listen, Taurus, your partner is telling me that they're hurt. Now, they could be hurt because their feelings are hurt or they're hurt because there's a third party. Now, Taurus, it could have been a rushing and going off, going hand passionately with a heated discussion or argument and some immature, premature communication concerning your partner's abundance here, okay? Something that they didn't know or were kept in the dark concerning it that is hurting their feelings, okay? Some type of words being exchanged concerning these coins. However, Taurus, your partner could tell me that, you know, a secret came out here. That someone was out being a player with a third party. Who, Taurus? Who, Taurus? Something that they saw when they went looking and spying. And this is the reason why you guys are stagnant and they're single. Taurus, your partner has the Ace of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love. A brand new beginning in a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing. A brand new blessing. A brand new beginning in love. So Taurus, new love, new start to love, or a blessing here? Clarify the Ace of Cups for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Cups for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Cups for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Four of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner taking a break, resting, recovering, meditating, praying, recharging their crystals. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys are on a break. Your partner could tell me that they're trying to recover or they're meditating on something here. Now Taurus, are you guys on a break over some type of blessing like money here? Could be dealing with these coins. Taurus, is it that your partner is telling me that you guys are on a break because someone has new love, a third party here? Now, they could be meditating on starting new. Taurus, your partner has the two of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner needing to make a decision. But they're in the dark about some things. Some things they just refuse to see, refuse to acknowledge. A lack of information. Block communication. So it's hard for them to make an informed decision in this position. But this is also a card of your partner being closed off, blocked off, not wanting to see, wanting to ignore, wanting to turn a blind eye. So Taurus, either your partner is indecisive or they're blocking. Clarify the two of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the two of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the two of swords. Flying cards here. Clarify the two of swords. For Taurus's partner. 
Clarify the Two of Swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Two of Swords for Taurus's partner. Okay. Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now, this can be the news about an offer for an invite out for dinner in a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value. This is the news or message of it. So Taurus, some type of news about practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or commitment. The news of it. Clarify the page of pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of pentacles for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the devil. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. But this devil energy can speak of a toxic energy that is looming over you guys' relationship. And what makes it toxic is this restrictive and binding. Someone may be obsessive, possessive, controlling, abusive. Someone may have an addiction to sex, drugs, drinking, smoking, working too much, money, attention, gambling, sports, video games, eating too much. Anything that a person does too much of. Or someone here is in a full-blown relationship somewhere else causing this toxic energy to loom over you guys' relationship. So Taurus could be dealing with a Capricorn. But when we're dealing with this devil energy, this can speak of something being toxic, restrictive, and binding. This can speak of a legal binding contract. But also temptation. Clarify the devil for Taurus' partner. Clarify the devil for Taurus' partner. Clarify the devil for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the king of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character. Someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go-getter, a take-charge type of energy. Someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their chart. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done, and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, or your partner is wanting to take action here. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Ace of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory. But this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. So, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys are having this communication. Your partner could tell me they've come into some truth and clarity. Your partner could tell me that they're making a decision or using this sword to sever. Now, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're tempted here over some news about maybe practicality, some type of blessing, money, assets, resources, property. They're tempted, but they're indecisive, needing to make a decision. Could be tempted in having this communication. However, Taurus... Your partner could tell me that you guys had this heated discussion or argument over the coins here, some type of news here, and it's a toxic situation, and they're just blocking communication here, okay? They don't even want to talk anymore. But Taurus, your partner could also tell me that something is toxic here. Someone accepted a gift, gave a gift, went out on a date with a third party here, and they're coming into this truth and clarity and maybe blocking communication or making a decision to block communication here, Taurus. Just block it out. Taurus, your partner has the Ace of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is a brand new opportunity of something more solid, stable, and secure coming into your partner. Now, this can be an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, Anything of value, brand new practical beginnings. 
So Taurus, some type of opportunity of practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or a commitment. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the sun. Could be dealing with a Leo, but the sun symbolizes exuberance, illumination, happiness, joy, peace, love, abundance, growth and development and freedom. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with a Leo, but your partner could tell me that they're happy. They want to be happy. They're over the moon or something was illuminated. Something came to light. Clarify the sun for Taurus's partner. Clarify the sun for Taurus's partner. Clarify the sun for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone coming into your partner or your partner coming in to apologize, to offer their cup of love and make the romantic gesture. So someone is saying, I'm sorry. Someone is trying to heal things, mend things, work things out. May even be coming in with a romantic gesture here. Clarify the Knight of Cups. For Taurus's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups. For Taurus's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups. For Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in their mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're all up in their head, stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep, bothered by something here. You know, Taurus, you know, your partner could tell me that something was illuminated, something came to light concerning these coins and some type of practicality here. And maybe they're just stressing and hoping for an apology here. Taurus, your partner could tell me that something was illuminated, something came to light, that someone accepted a gift, gave a gift, went out on a date with someone else, and maybe even experienced or saw or realized some type of romantic gesture going on with a third party here. You know, Taurus, it could be you coming in to apologize and your partner's like beating themselves up, wanting to be happy, and maybe meditating on this offer of, you know, practicality or commitment or token of love that may be coming in here. Taurus, your partner has the five of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner feeling neglected, abandoned, excluded, left out in the cold. This can speak to financial lack and poverty consciousness. This could be a breakup. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that something is going on financially, maybe some type of financial lack, or there's a breakup. Clarify the five of pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the five of pentacles for Taurus's partner. Clarify the five of pentacles for Taurus's partner. Taurus, you're at the bottom of the deck. It is clarified with the nine of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is wish fulfillment. But this can also speak to your partner feeling smug or overindulging in alcohol or substance abuse. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish. Could be feeling smug here or overindulging, trying to numb out. Now, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that, hey, I was suffering some type of financial lack, but there is opportunity coming in here. So maybe getting their wish after suffering some type of financial lack. Your partner could tell me that they're overindulging, trying to numb out because of this financial lack. However, Taurus, your partner could tell me that they're overindulging, trying to numb out because you guys broke up. Now they're single because there's a third party secret coming out. Taurus, this is a peek at your partner for the week of March the 12th through March the 18th, 2023. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Maj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.